I'm Keith Braun from Calgary, Alberta, Canada, and I'm a Paddle Canada sea kayaking instructor as well as a, a track kayak pilot. And my wife and I have been paddling the track kayaks for over 10 years now, and we've paddled lakes and rivers of BC and Alberta as well as many multi-day trips in the Pacific Northwest and also Cuba and Belize and Mexico. It's been amazing, absolutely amazing. What I love so much about the track kayak is its durability and its, uh, its, its ease of travel. Let's open up this box. Nice, so this is a harness. This is what uh, enables us to carry the boat on our back. It's got fabulous support on the back as well, proper strappings. So this is a pro pack or the pro kit. And this is a dry bag that goes with it for expedition trips. Works, it's gonna work awesome. All right, fantastic. Oh, I'm looking forward to this. Double bungees as well for um, good secure seal around the combing. Okay. Fantastic. So a buoyancy um, storage bag. -hoo 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 -hoo. Awesome. This is amazing. If if I know I can't show on 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 film, but these are feather light. It's incredible. And uh, carbon carbon fiber construction as well. Blue for bow, red for stern. Okay, this is the, the sock as well for added buoyancy protection in the boat. Oh, man. Check this out. So the old track seats were comfortable. I never had any problems with the boats at all. I spent, there are days I spent 13, 15 hours in the boat and never had any numb butt, but uh, this is way more cushiony. It's got holes as well for easy drain of water so you keep your bum dry. And then this is a separate back strap as well for lumber support. And it's going to, I'm sure it's gonna fit really well for self-rescues as well. Combing's pretty much the same. Fantastic thigh braces on them and they're adjustable as well, both laterally and also vertically along the, along the combing. So this is the stern. Remember blue for bow, red for stern. Clips together really easy. Nice. Same thing. Shorter sections. Again, to be able to fit into a smaller bag. That bag is awesome, by the way, for travel. It's a lot smaller than the old bags. A lot lighter as well, because of the overall size or weight of the boat. Oh man, this is coming together nice. Really nice. Oh, nice. Silver on red, really sexy aesthetics. Okay. Nice hip pads, very nice, fantastic. And they're adjustable as well, so it's not just one size, you can actually snug yourself really in tight in this boat or actually loosen it off as well, so looking forward to trying those out. And these jacks. These jacks are so light, unbelievable. Color-coded as well. The, uh, the valve is, is uh, really sensitive and it's much easier to, uh, to open and close as well. Love this jack. V, to the, to the point of the boat where you're working on, Just like that, and unbelievable. Like I've been paddling these boats for a long time. <laughs> I mean, when you pick up, in my other boat, when you pick up the frame, you know you're picking up a frame. This is just so stinking light, it's unbelievable. I mean, it's just pretty straightforward from beginning to end. Same thing, 
Just unbelievable. It's like you don't even have anything in your hand. Wow, and even I can tell by putting the frame in that those ribs do not give at all. The old ribs, they had a little bit of flex to them and when you pushed it in, you, can, you could feel it. But these are just rock solid. Shaping up, looking good. Now one thing that I noticed that was different from the previous boat, so the old one had a clip at the back they had to pull and, uh, and release the, uh, uh, the combing. But in this case, it's just a pull down pin. So what I like to do, just put the notch at the back, set the combing in, just like that. Put it in place, pull the pin down. It's super simple, just easy as pie. It's fantastic. Okay, let's put these jacks in and see how they fit. Gunnel jacks fit in really nice. Yeah, it's just nice and smooth. And then, uh, check out the rocker on that boat. And I even cranked it up all the way. So you wanna go straight and long and fast and track without any weather caulking. Just let the keter or the, the keel jack loose and it just flattens out really, really nice and, and goes uh, straight as can be. If you want to actually play and surf, put on a rocker like this and it's gonna turn on a dime. These rigid chines are really nice as well with the tracking and also with the turning. Fantastic, love it. Okay, okay, let's get the seat in. Again, really love this backrest. Nice. It's gonna work really well for self-rescues. That boat, the, the back isn't gonna collapse in on you when you're trying to get in back in the boat. And uh, I love that backrest. It looks so comfortable. I like a backrest with some lumbar support. So I'm looking forward to seeing what that feels like in the water. All right, let's take a look at this boat. So you can see that they have, again, they have reflective uh, safety lines on the, on, the, on the sides as well. And they've added additional strap at the front here for, uh, for a spare paddle as well. They're really nicely set apart. They brought, they're, they're up forward, so they're not gonna get in the way of your, of your uh, strokes as well. And uh, this is really cool, I love this. Um, I wasn't certain what to think about it at first, but you know what, it's fantastic. It's got a lot of versatility. I can see that this is not the only way that you have to actually integrate this. You can take this and actually do um, lateral straps or you can zigzag them like this. Really love it. But what I love most about it is that you can open up the Keter without these interfering at all. It's fantastic. And again, what I really love about this is that this is removable if you wanted to take that out. Okay, and I see that at the back here that they also have, they've incorporated bungee into the back of these so they've got a, an easy safety catch line that, uh, that can be used in rescues. And then of course, a really comfortable toggle to carry the boat with as well. Really comfortable, fits in the hand well. And even with a loaded boat, it's not gonna put strain on the hand. Let's take a look at the hull of the boat. So again, really nice and clean boat. I've, I've paddled my boat for 10 years and it's sure it's got little scores here and there, but it's, it's fantastic. And I don't, I don't baby my boat, I beat it up. Like I've took it uh, rock guarding this spring and took it surfing out on the West Coast and it just takes a lick and it's incredible. And of course, really solid. I love the chine of this boat too. It's a, it's a rigid, chine which means that you're gonna have a really solid secondary on this boat you can lay it on its side and it just it just sits there solid it's really nice and also you put it on its edge and it wants to turn it really depending upon the rocker that you have on the boat is really gonna dictate how much it's gonna to want to turn but uh, that's also the nice part about this is is uh, you can you can actually 
change the dynamics of this boat so that it performs in which way you want, whether you're surfing or whether you want to crank out some miles. So love it, absolutely love it. And, you know I think I just fell in love all over again <laughs> honestly I love my track I've been paddling it for 10 years and I keep bragging about it and I just got into this and I don't know I'm gonna give this boat back man it's so responsive you know it's it's just an all-round perfect boat for all uses I, I can't think of a better boat that uh, it's the ultimate touring kayak travel all over the world with it, put it in a bag, put it on your back, get through um, every airport in the world and put it on every water in the world and, and feel very stable, very comfortable, very seaworthy. Thanks Track for allowing me to take this out and give it the first paddle. Love it, love it, love it. Thank you Track. <laughs>